The wildfires that ripped through California in 2018 were the most destructive in state history. On November 8, 2018, a wildfire broke out near Polga, California, and within a few hours, it had engulfed the densely populated town of Paradise. The fire destroyed over 6,400 residences and 260 commercial buildings across Butte County. Sadly, the fire also killed at least 86 people and essentially erased the town of Paradise from the map. Among those who lost their homes was a coin collector named Joseph Best. There wasn't much time for him to escape, and leaving nearly everything behind, he became stuck in bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic as the town burned around him. As he sat in traffic, attempting to escape, he managed to capture these haunting images of the fire just off the road. The numismatic community rallied to support Best, starting a GoFundMe that raised more than $12,000 for he and other family members who also lost their homes. The community also agonized with Best as he waited to regain access to Paradise to assess the damage to his home and recover any valuables, including his coin collection. Best was finally allowed to return a month later on December 9th to find his home in utter ruin, burned to the ground by the intense fire. Although much of his collection was stored in a fireproof safe, things did not look good as the fire reached very high temperatures for several hours. Best located his safe, which had ended up on its side. Inside, his collection remained somewhat intact, but the plastic boxes and coin holders had melted due to the intense heat. After seeing these sobering photos, a representative from Numismatic Guarantee Corporation reached out to Best early the next day and offered the services of NGC and Numismatic Conservation Services free of charge. Best gladly accepted and plans were quickly made for him to drop the coins off at the NGC booth at the Florida United Numismatists show in Orlando in early January. Best remained positive, knowing his coins would be in good hands. In all, Best dropped off 48 NGC graded coins on Friday, January 8th for conservation, grading, and reencapsulation. Later that same night, Best and his son were guests of honor at the NGC PMG Collector Society cocktail reception. There, they met with NGC President Rick Montgomery, who was not only shown some of the devastating images he captured, but also heard their harrowing tale of escape. Many of the holders suffered significant damage from the high temperatures, and each coin had to be carefully extricated from the melted plastic, conserved by NCS professionals, regraded by NGC, and then re-encapsulated. Because of the way the safe ended up on its side and the heat of the fire, many of the coins actually became entombed in the left side of the core of the NGC holders. After a month of careful conservation, NGC and NCS are happy to announce that Best's NGC certified coins have been restored. The coins are now re-encapsulated in new, attractive Edgeview NGC holders. Best's collection includes colorful and high-grade buffalo nickels, some of his favorite pieces. Fortunately, the nickels all weathered the heat and emerged from the melted slabs unscathed. The coins still retained their original mint luster and beautiful rainbow-like toning. This particular piece graded NGC MS64 star and this one MS66 star. The collection also includes some other classic vintage coins, like this 1921 piece dollar, the only year that they were minted in high relief. A nicely toned mercury dime graded NGC MS66 full bands, and a 1909D $5 gold piece. Other proof coins were also remarkably preserved. 
Best's collection also includes a thin type Norse American metal, the rarer of the two varieties. NGC president Rick Montgomery said, After such terrible natural disasters, it is important that we come together to support each other in the numismatic community. We were very happy we were able to help Joe restore his collection and give him one less thing to worry about. Everyone at NGC and NCS was so pleased to see how well the NGC holders protected Joe's numismatic treasures.